Cauliflower is a delicious, really easy to cook vegetable. Um, before we get started, I want to address the camera directly. There's one correct way to pronounce this beautiful vegetable in front of me, and that's cauliflower, not cauliflower. So there's that. Now that that's been said, we can move on. I think so. Yeah. You can make it into soups and stews, mash, roast, boil it. It's available nearly all year round in the supermarket. It can be a little intimidating to cook. What do you do with the leaves? How do you break in? And how do you get beautiful florets without making a mess everywhere? So I'm here to show you the best way to break down a cauliflower. Before I get into the best and the cleanest and the easiest way to break down a cauliflower, I'm gonna try a user submitted tip. And by user, I mean one of the lovely coworkers in this building said, don't you just smash it in the bag? To which I said, what? So I have a beautiful bagged cauliflower here. Um, it looks pretty fresh and lovely and I'm gonna smash it. I don't, I've never seen this before. I've never been encouraged to smash things. She said she does it in here. Where you were going to whack it. Okay, I think I'm gonna do this. Leave it I am smashing the cauliflower. <laughs> Shall we? There we go. Does anyone else do this? Ooh, okay. I just smashed the cauliflower. Okay, so let's assess. It does, it, it technically works. We have cauliflower um, and this. Over here, I'm gonna show you the best way to cut a cauliflower. It's gonna be a lot less messy and result in even florets without all of this rubble. So the first thing I'm going to do Peel away some of these leaves. One way to cut a cauliflower is to set it on its stem, cut it into quarters, and cut away at the fibrous stem in the center. But then you are cutting the florets into pieces and you get a lot of rubble on your board. So the easiest and best way is actually to just cut away florets from the stem. You leave the stem intact, and they pop right off. This is a more meditative and calmer method. <laughs> a little more peaceful. If you don't have any anger to work out after work, there we go. Okay, so now I have these nice clusters. I have my stem and my leaves over here. Um, I can break this down, this pretty large cluster, by cutting along these stem lines, but really let it naturally break where it wants to and it pops right out. Okay, let's take a look. We have the smashed cauliflower. It did work. I have some florets. Uh, there's leaves attached. They're really different sizes. I have, um, have this thing left. It's a little gnarly for my taste, but it was kind of fun. And now the best way to break down a cauliflower. So here's my rubble, I'm gonna be totally honest a few small leaves and a few small bits of cauliflower. I'll go this way. But you always have to have fun in the kitchen and you always have to experiment. So I'm glad I smashed the cauliflower. Special thanks to Mora who gave us this wonderful cauliflower smashing tip. Um, let's cook together. You don't want to cook with her. <laughs> but why would you want to cook with her if she does this? Because maybe I can teach her this. Please. <laughs> 